What's going on, guys? Crazy Tales One back with another episode of Hustle, Loyalty, and Disrespect from 2K Showcase. If you like today's video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe and stay out to my channel. We last left off, we did the CM Punk vs. John Cena Raw 1000 match where you saw CM Punk turn hill as he attacked the Rock and gave him the GTS. And now we're on to CM Punk, John Cena vs. Big Show, and Dan Bryan on Raw. So let's get started, shall we? In the tag team match. Challengers forced to tag team on Monday Night Raw? Let's find out. CM Punk attacks The Rock at the end of Raw 1000. CM Punk says The Rock showed him no respect and believes that he deserves respect as the WWE Champion. Hmm. Like I said, I love how they recreate this stuff. AJ Lee, the Raw General Manager, decides to put John C and CM Punk in a tag team match together. Against Big Show and Dan Bryan, Dan Bryan and John Cena involved during a match between CM Punk and Big Show earlier in the night. Hmm, interesting. Up next, CM Punk and John Cena versus Big Show and Dan Bryan. Let's get started. It's the big bad shoulder now. This is a like I said, the way these entrances are is just so amazing. Like Big Show. Standing at seven feet. This looks amazing. 141 pounds. The Big Show. King, a seven feet tall and well over 400 pounds. Big Show. <sighs> I mean, I know 2K15 is not well received by others because of just how slow the match pacing and they took out. My only complaint about 2K15 because I'm loving my career mode. I didn't even touch universe mode yet, which I do plan on doing for my channel. So I love my career mode, so like you see, I'm having a blast with that. I reclaimed my NXT title against Sami Zayn. Going back and forth, I have no idea what's happening with that. But otherwise, yeah, I'm loving my career mode. I can't wait to do universe mode in 2K Showcase. I'm loving it. We live feuds, specific feuds. It just like I also love how Debbie rivalries on Debbie Network, how they do the feuds. I just love how they do that. The only complaint I have about this game really is just a lack of match types. That's it. And yes, the roster it could be b a little bit more bigger. I oh, see they got Dan Bryan, right? No. No. He looks so. Look at him. Tell me that's not Dan Bryan. That's how realistic this game is. This man, Daniel Bryan, has not been the same since AJ left him at the altar. <laughs> and to make matters worse, no, no. AJ recently ordered Daniel Bryan to undergo a psychiatric evaluation. <laughs> Why? No. 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 I still don't understand. They could have did so many other robberies. John Cena and Randy Orton, which would have spanned almost how many years? Could they still robbed like six years? They could have did that. Undertaker versus Kane. All these robberies. Rock versus Stone Cold. Rock versus Triple H. I mean, I like the robbery that they picked CM Punk and John Cena, Triple H, Shawn Michaels, and we got the DLC. With. Chris and Raynor, which I can't wait to play because those matches were so epic to me, especially the over limit match that they had. That was like probably like my one of my favorite matches of all time, if any. And they got Mark Henry's Hall of Pain dominance throughout 2000. Um, what you call it? 11, I think it was. Yeah, it was 2011. Well, you're right about that because not only will he be in the ring with both Big Show and John Cena, but under triple threat rules. And then we got the Ultimate Warrior one, which should be interesting. You know, in tribute to Ultimate Warrior. I wonder how this is going to approach it from now on. Since 2K just do rivalry, which I have no problem. So I understand why only did two. Okay, they had to save some for next year. They should have, it's like we should vote which rivalry should be in the next year's game. So it'd be interesting is that they can only put two in the game and have DLC later for it. I know they do every rivalry in WWE history 
What the hell is next year's game going to be about? Let's see how that works. And next year, do not put on Xbox 60 and PS4. Damn it. <laughs> I was holding it back. And here comes John Cena. Here we go. I love how they recreated that. They did it perfectly. Only they added more lines. He always say something different. And this Sunday is as big as it gets. Again, you're off cue. He was off cue, but okay. And here we go. This match was made earlier tonight by Raw General Manager AJ Lee after Daniel Bryan interfered in the Big Show versus CM Punk matchup. Yeah, Daniel Bryan completely lost it earlier tonight. Claiming he Again. in the Sunday's WWE Championship match at SummerSlam. And he tried to prove it by placing CM Punk in the no lock. That's not doing that. Daniel Bryan's mental state being what it was. Damn, Daniel Bryan's good. Probably still be cinched in if it wasn't for Big Show breaking it up. John Cena with the offense. He's putting those educated feet to good use. A sharp elbow drop. Boom, that's what I'm talking about. What strength. He said after formalities. <laughs> saw that one coming. Oh, a lot of successes in that Damn. right now, Cole. All four men in this matchup are former world heavyweight champions. Of course, the most recent being Daniel Bryan. Oh, that's true. Championship is Sheamus in just 18 seconds at WrestleMania. John Cena was world heavy champion at one point. Big show. Well, I bet John Cena came world heavy champion again. Well, not in this part of the game showcase. Big show was world heavy champion. Puck was obviously world heavyweight champion. A lot of stuff. Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. I need to take those legs out. His, he, are da he is dangerous with those legs. Every time he hears the WWE Universe chant, yes! Which results in Daniel Bryan chanting, no, at the WWE Universe every single time. Yeah, I don't know if Daniel Bryan realizes it, but every time he screams no, the yes chants get even louder. Daniel Bryan will have his hands full this Sunday at SummerSlam when he squares off against Kane. And that match was made by our new Raw general manager and former fiancé of Daniel Bryan, AJ Lee. You know, the psychologist may have declared Daniel Bryan sane, but after being put in a match with Kane by your former fiancé, I wouldn't blame Daniel Bryan if he went a little batty. And let's not forget that AJ Lee informed Daniel Bryan of his match with Kane after... Brian Damn it. Requested and was denied a WWE Championship match. It's no wonder Brian acts the way he does. Last week, we saw John Cena defeat Daniel Bryan in their first ever one-on-one -on -one matchup on Raw. Yeah, but the big news came after the match when Big Show flattened both John Cena and CM Punk with knockout punches as Raw went off the air. And if that happens again this Sunday, we will undoubtedly have Come on. a new WWE Champion. Come on. Don't get up. Uh-oh, trying to put him away. Attitude adjustment. John Cena. Earlier this year, Big Show nearly became Mr. Money in the Bank. But when the handle snapped in the briefcase, the contract ended up in John Cena's hands. And of course, John Cena used his Money in the Bank contract to challenge CM Punk for the WWE Championship at Raw 1000. And unlike most Money in the Bank contract holders, I love how mostly dominating this match. <laughs> CM Punk 
advance warning as to when he was going to cash in. Turned out to be a big mistake because unlike every other superstar... I tag him, Punk. I actually don't remember how this match played out. Big Show looking to become boom, boom, boom. a three-time WWE Champion this Sunday at SummerSlam. And if victorious, it would mark the first time in nearly 10 years Big Show is the WWE Champion. Yeah, but in between that time, however, Big Show has been no stranger to championship reigns. He's been World Heavyweight Champion, ECW Champion, Intercontinental Champion, U.S. Champion, Tag Team Champion. Ooh. You name it, he's been the champion of it. If John Cena can be successful this Sunday at SummerSlam, he'll become an amazing 11 time WWE. Oh, yeah, CM Punk also did that. A record number of WWE Championship reigns. But let's not get ahead of ourselves here, Cole. Getting past Big Show and Thank you, Punk, for helping out. I guess I should tag you. Gang, did you ever think there'd be a day when we saw John Cena and CM Punk on the same team? Given their history together, not in a million years. These two have been heated rivals. Than a year. And judging from the reactions when AJ Lee made this match here tonight, I don't think either one of them is thrilled. Here we go. A puck really taking it to the big show here. Damn. Ooh. Hey. Daniel Bryan just tagged himself in. <laughs> no. About to finish Punk off. And, and, wait a minute. Is, is Big Show leaving? I guess he is. No. 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 Of CM Punk. Oh. Ooh. CM Punk God damn. Brian down and Cena just chomping at the bit waiting for a tag. Look at this. Here we go. CM Punk, ooh, the running bulldog, and that makes <laughs> it. Cena wins in. Critical moment here for Punk and Brian. Come on. Punk talk. Give me a two. Come on. Oh, look at Punk saying, oh, now you want in, huh? Damn. And a shoulder tackle. Wait a minute. Whoa. Who does that look like, kid? Wait a minute. Does see a Punk actually? He's Calvin. You know. Here, look at this. He's not gonna, is he? Wow. Goodness. You can't pump me. Uh oh. Oh, Cena made a tag. And now Cena. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot he did this. And <laughs> I love how he recreated that. Saying, okay, go ahead. Take your business yourself. I'll take my ball and go or I'll take my championship and go home. Go ahead, buddy. Come on, be, be the shot. Be the man. Damn. <laughs> He's super mad. Now with both their partners going out in the ring, Daniel Bryan and John Cena square off. Now here comes the correct five knuckle shuffle. Hit all of that. John Cena. If Daniel Bryan here we go. John Cena or CM Punk. Put it all on the line. A few weeks ago, this match would be over in a hurry. Yes, pin. Attitude adjustment. Come on. One, two, three. And Cena picks up the win. John Cena with the victory. <laughs> Damn. Pinning Daniel Bryan. Here are your winners. The team of CM Punk and John Cena. But it is a team victory for John Cena and CM Punk. Well, Big Joe saying, I told you so. And John Cena does it alone after CM Punk takes the walk. Hey, wait a minute. Big Show in the ring after Cena. And look out. Oh, blasting Big Show with the title. He Did he just save him? Come on.
He's like, whatever. Well, CMC and Punk was trying to be nice. He was trying to be nice. Guess he didn't want it. Hmm, now here's a preview of what's happening. Yeah, triple threat match. So thank you guys for watching another 2K Showcase Hustle Wars in Disrespect. Wait today's episode. Make sure to hit that like button, comment down below, and subscribe and stay also to my channel. Thank you for watching. This is Crazy Tales 1. Signing off, I'll catch you guys later. See ya.